Hello and welcome to the video guys, it's Militated here and today I'm going to be showing you how to equip any utility vest onto the new outfits that have the pouches without doing the transfer glitch. Secondly, I'm going to show you how to change the top without removing the pouches. However, if you do change the top then you won't be able to use a utility vest. If the top that you pick is compatible then you can use the interaction menu body armor instead. If you want to be able to use a different top, keep the utility vest and have the pouches on at the same time, then you will need to follow the transfer version which I'll link down in the description below. But as I said, this video is not the transfer version so you do get to keep all of your outfits. So just to reiterate, you're going to be able to put any utility vest onto any of these four outfits that have the pouches on the front. Also if you don't care about the utility vest, then we will be able to change the top while still keeping the pouches. As a side note, you can only do it with these four outfits, so you can't use the one with the black pouches from the Diamond Casino heist. To begin, we're simply going to pick the outfit that we want to start with, and then we're going to make sure that we save this in Outfit Slot 1, and we're going to call it Merge Pouches. To clarify, it has to be in Slot 1, so don't save it in any other one. With that done, we're then going to go into the Heist Coveralls category, and we're going to purchase any of the four outfits at the bottom that have the Chemical Mask. It does not matter which colour you pick. Now that we have that equipped, we're going to go down to the telescopes at Del Piro Pier. Once we arrive, we're then going to sprint towards the telescope at an angle and you're going to press right on the d-pad as soon as you get near it. You should just stand there with no mask. So we're now going to open up the interaction menu and go into style and we're going to equip the outfit that we just saved in the clothing store which is in slot 1. The chemical mask will then appear on the outfit when you walk away from the telescope which is exactly what we need. We're then going to go back to the ammunition and we're going to make sure that we save this outfit once again in slot 1. After it's saved, we're then going to back out of the top section and open up the interaction menu. From here we're going to go into style and go down to outfit and you're going to equip any random saved outfit that you have, it doesn't matter which one it is. We're then going to re-equip the outfit that we just saved with the chemical mask. I know that seems pointless but you just have to do it. You also want to make sure that your spawn location is set to last location in the interaction menu. Now press start and go to online and we're going to go to jobs, play job, rockstar created and go down to missions. From here we're going to start up a titan of a job which is at the top of the list. When it loads you're then going to confirm the settings and launch the job on your own. Of course I decided to speed that up but you'll then spawn into the mission without the vest and without the chemical mask. If you happen to spawn outside like I did then all you need to do is run back into the ammunition and we're going to start browsing the top section. Once again we're going to make sure that we save this outfit in slot 1. Again it has to be slot 1 so do not try to save it anywhere else. We're then going to bring up the phone and quit the job which will then take you down into a free mode session. As you can see we're still wearing the outfit but this one is actually a little bit different to the one that we just saved in the mission despite there being no visual difference. I'll show you what I mean later on but for now we're just going to go and make sure that we save this one in an empty outfit slot. I decided to call it for later as we're saving this one for later. Ok so we're now going to go back into the top section and we're going to go into the utility vest category. At this point you're free to pick whichever utility vest that you want to put on the outfit. To match with the rest of the outfit, I'm going to be using the forest camera armour, but once again you can use any utility vest that you want. Before we go any further, just make sure that you own an earpiece but do not equip it. Next we're then going to press the start button and we're going to go back over to online. From here we're going to go into jobs, play job, rockstar created, go down to verses and we're going to start up the mission called crooked cop. We only need to do crooked cop once and then we can merge as many utility vests as we want solo. When the settings screen loads up, we're going to make sure that clothing is set to player owned and then we're going to confirm the settings. With that done, you then need to invite one other person. You can use auto invite like I did to get a random, or you can invite a friend if you happen to have one online. Alternatively, you can also join the Militated Discord server to find someone to help you there. The invite link is in the description. Once someone has joined and you have launched the mission, it will then bring you to the outfit selection screen. Now go down to own outfit and press right once to equip the merge pouches outfit. Again, this is the saved outfit that was in outfit slot 1. You can now see that the vest has merged onto the outfit, so once we're in the mission, we're going to open up the interaction menu. From here we're going to go into style and accessories and press left once on where it says gear to equip an earpiece. Then bring up the phone and quit the job. You'll then spawn into a free mode online session while still wearing the merged outfit from the mission. Ok, so we're now going to go back into the ammunition and start browsing the top section. Just make sure that you go and save this outfit into an empty outfit slot and then we can come back to that outfit later on in the video. So if you want to do another outfit with a different vest, you can now do it very easily. You don't need to do Crooked Cop again unless you restart your game. So to do it, we're going to go back into the Utility Vest category and you're going to pick your desired vest. With that equipped, we're then going to back out of the top section and press Start. 
From here we're going to go back into online, go to jobs, play job, rockstar created and go back to missions. Simply just start a titan of a job the exact same way as we did it the first time. This time though you will spawn into the mission with the vest already merged to the outfit that was in slot 1 which is called merge pouches. Now just go into the ammunition and save this outfit into an empty outfit slot. Once that's done you can then open up the phone and quit the job. And that is how easy it is to merge the utility vests onto the merge outfit after doing crooked cop just once. So you can then go and repeat that as many times as you want with that outfit with different utility vests. As you can see I decided to do 3 different vests for demonstration purposes but you can do as many as you want. Okay so we're now going to move on to the next part which is changing the top but keeping the pouches. So if you try to change the top now you might notice that the pouches will disappear. In order to do it we're going to back out of the top section and open up the interaction menu. From here we're going to go to style and go down to outfit and equip the outfit called for later which we saved earlier on. Again this is different from the outfit that is in slot 1 which we saved in the mission. If you forgot we saved this one in the free mode session. You won't be able to equip a utility vest with this outfit but you are free to change the top without the pouches disappearing. As I said at the start of the video though if you really do want a vest on this outfit then you can pick a top which is compatible with the interaction menu body armor and you can use one of those. As an alternative you can also equip a parachute from the interaction menu and these straps will make it look like webbing that holds the pouches together. But like I said if you really wanted to you could then go into inventory and body armor and equip the vest that you wanted on it. I did mention this earlier but if you want to be able to change the top, keep the plate carrier and have the pouches on at the same time then you will need to do the transfer version of this glitch. I've left the video link in the description if you want to do that one. The last thing I'm going to cover is what to do when you want to make more outfits but with different pouches. For example I'm now going to switch to the coordinator outfit which has the new style tan pouches. To begin we're going to need to save this in outfit slot 1 which is going to overwrite the merge pouches outfit. You then just need to repeat the steps from before, so you're going to glitch the mask from the chemical suit onto the outfit. Head down to the ammunition and resave it in slot 1. We then need to equip a random saved outfit from the interaction menu and switch back to the one that we just saved. You might need to equip it twice for the mask to show. Next is to start a titan of a job and then you're going to save the outfit once again in slot 1. Quit the job from the phone after doing that and then you're going to go and save the outfit once again down in the free mode session, but this time we're going to do it in an empty outfit slot. After that saved, you're then free to go into the utility vest category and pick the utility vest that you want to put on the outfit. At this point, you're then going to start up a titan of a job to merge the vest. However, if you have restarted GTA since the last time you did Crooked Cop, then you will need to go and do Crooked Cop again instead. As I haven't restarted GTA, I'm going to go back into missions and start up a titan of a job. Exactly the same as before, you're then going to spawn into the mission with the vest on the outfit with the pouches. Simply just head back inside the ammunition and you're going to make sure that you save this outfit in an empty outfit slot. Do not save it in slot 1 as we already have the vest merged onto it. After that you're then going to leave the job and you're free to put on a different utility vest if you want to go and make more outfits. However if you just want to change the top and keep the pouches then go and equip the 4 later tan outfit that we saved not too long ago. Just like before you're then free to go and put on whichever top you want with the outfit and the pouches will remain. Before we finish up, you are free to go and customise the outfits however you like after you are done. Of course on the outfits with the utility vest, you can't change the vest or the top. But that is pretty much it, so thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did then be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel just in case you haven't done so already. Don't forget to join the Militated Discord server, the invite link is in the description and you can also follow me on Instagram at officialmilitated. But once again thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next GTA Online video.